Well, with Halloween behind us, we're getting ready for a popular holiday attraction. New at 6, Fox 2 meteorologist Jamie Travers checks in with a St. Louis staple to see how the setup is going before the exhibit opens in a few weeks. Annual traditions are coming into full bloom at the Missouri Botanical Garden as a unique one of a kind event returns later this month. Setup for this year's Garden Glow began back in July as it takes months to transition every garden into a bulb garden with over 2 million lights on display. We are really trying to bridge that connection between our holiday light show and the work we're doing here every single day at the Botanical Garden when it comes to plant conservation and research. The dry fall weather has been beneficial to the staff. We've had a lot of really nice days here in St. Louis lately, so that really helps when it comes to Garden Glow setup. Um, you know, not having to work in the rain really makes it a lot more of an enjoyable experience. And visitors are impressed with the final outcome. And the way it looks when they're done is really amazing to me because there's so much so much work that goes into it and it ends up being a beautiful thing. You can take your time and stop wherever you want and observe. It's nice. The crew puts their hearts and souls into the event up until the very last minute and even throughout the entire Garden Glow season. We want people to have a consistent experience. If you come when we first open in mid-November to the beginning of January, it's a, the same experience every time. The glow begins on November 15th for garden members and on the 16th for the general public. And organizers recommend getting your tickets ahead of time because certain dates, especially around Thanksgiving and Christmas, sell out well in advance. Reporting for the Missouri Botanical Garden, I'm meteorologist Jamie Travers.